17 year contractor here. We sold three fourths of our company last year. And then two weeks later, FedEx announced the new minimum scale, putting us below the new scale. Leah, how often have we heard that one? We had intended to sell the remainder after a year of completing our exit plan. What do you think is the expected timeline before we are on a get bigger or get out list? Leah, what do you think? Oh, I, you know, you may have a couple months leeway here, but if you already know that you're below scale, I would say that's going to come sooner than later. Um, we have seen businesses kind of similar situations where they want to sell a small piece of their business that previously a couple months ago would have been a okay to sell it. Uh, and now they can't do that. And FedEx is like, you know, if you split your business in two or whatever, you're not going to be big enough. And those sales just don't go through. We can't at this point, I've seen them. They just FedEx just says no, um, find more or you can't sell. Um, so I would say I, I don't have a definitive timeline on it because again, terminal dependent, I hate to you know always lean on that, but it is, but I would say definitely, definitely expect that get bigger, get out sooner than later. Cause we're already starting to see it across the market. Yeah. A lot of contractors that I'm seeing here anonymous, they're, what they're doing is they're getting with another contractor in their building and saying, Hey, can we put our territories together? So it's sort of the opposite of a carve out, right? It's, we're going to combine our two businesses where, you know, each one, each of them is a carve out and we're going to treat it as one, sell it as a whole. That's probably the way that, that, that FedEx would like to see it done, uh, or one would just absorb the other. That's the kind of the two ways of looking at it. If both of you are looking at selling, combine them and sell to a third party, that's great. Or maybe one just wants to absorb the other. What I have not seen happen is you're not going to just be told to get out. I mean, F FedEx knows, they, they knew when they set the new minimums that some contractors were then going to be under the minimums. Because they, you have a contract, right? They're, they, they're not just going to not renew it. Now, sometimes they might, but that's pretty rare. So when you get it under scale, that's, it's not really the end of the world. You typically in a lot of markets can grow out of that organically. So more population density, things like that, not always, but FedEx in general is not going to say you have six months to figure out a way to grow your business or combine, or we're kicking you out because the next person that comes in, if you've not found a way to combine, the very next person is going to be in the same boat, right? So they're typically just going to let you grow organically or combine with somebody else at that point.